so I thought I would hop on here quick and give a harvest update. Uh, so we are in our second to last farm. Um, this farm is actually about 13 miles from where we live. If you're wondering why do we farm 13 miles away, because this is my husband's grandfather's farm. And uh, we bought this about uh, 40 years ago and we've made it work. And so yeah, so as far as this farm and harvesting, uh, we started on this basically yesterday. I harvested over 80 acres yesterday. Um, yields are good where the corn is growing, but we got a couple issues on this farm. We've got a couple drowned out spots. Can't see them from here, um, but it's quite a bit. And it was very painful to have to drive through those areas with absolutely nothing growing. Um, but we may have figured out what might be going on. So from what I understand, uh, it's possible that the uh, might be a major tile broke. And that would be actually really good news if that was the case. So I'm not sure if we'll finish this up today. There's not a lot of acres here, but we're waiting on the corn dryer. Uh, if you're wondering why do we dry our corn, basically we don't want it to rot. So we've got to get the moisture down, get the moisture out so that we can store it. So I'm going to start here. I've got a truck there that I can start to fill. I've got a grain cart over there. Um, it's going to be slow going. I think there's just going to be two of us running today just because the corn dryer is very full. So, um, yeah, so after we're done harvesting, if you can see, there's actually some hog barns over there. Um, so we're going to actually get three of the hog barns of manure and that will be applied to this farm also when we're done here. So looking forward to having some lunch. Uh, we will have a pork chop on a stick, compliments of Elm Creek Agronomy uh, will be delivering. So we're looking forward to that. You really have no idea how much we appreciate that. You know, especially with uh, me being the female combine um, driver. So I'm not home making meals. And you know, yes, I can put ham sandwiches together and we do, that's not a problem. But sure nice to have a meal delivered here and there. It just really keeps us going. So with that, I'm gonna hop in the combine here and I'm gonna take off and uh, we'll talk to you all later. Thank